This will do. Thank you, Eivor. Anything to help you feel at home? I am most at home helping others. May we return to the subject of your visions? We could, if you think it worth something. I need one more ingredient to finish an elixir for you. Look around the pond there. You will find what I require. Once brewed, this elixir will help you dive deeper into your visions, to see them more clearly. I have the plans you need. Good, good. Once added to the elixir, it will be ready to drink. In taking this, you will have access to the All Father's wisdom. You will walk the path of Odin and live as he lived so long ago. Prepare yourself for a journey into another time, another plane. The elixir is ready. It will taste like misery itself, but it will open your mind to the sights and sounds of the Nine Worlds. Prophecies of the Nornir are as clear as daylight. The Aesir are doomed. All Asgard is doomed. Repeat the last passage. Brothers will fight one another and kill one another. The home of the gods turns red with gore. It will be an age of storms. An age of wolves. Not this. 
Further along. The foretelling of a wolf. A great beast. The wolf Fenrir howls terribly before the gates to hell. The beast will break its bonds and run. And my part? What about me? Then comes the second great sorrow. When the Harvey goes to fight the wolf. And falls to Fenrir. And falls to Fenrir. It's there, you see. You have foretold my death. Your Harvey will die. We speak what we see. We know your fate. Your destiny. Have you gleaned enough, O oh wise one? Why struggle and fight if we are but threats stretched between anchored points? Without hope, life is a prison, not a gift. Life is the music that comes from playing those threats. That is what lifts our spirits and fills our hearts. I am no string to be plucked or tied. I am the High One, the Lord of Ecstasy, the enemy of the Wolf. I am eternal. Riddled words only cloud my thoughts. A storm is brewing. Not in the clouds, but down below. Does our final battle draw near? Is this how Ragnarok begins? We must decide. You don't decide the thing. Who is balls? We are as guardians. We don't skulk around like elves. We fight. We are fighting for our homes, for our people. But some problems can't be solved with the hard end of a hammer. Name one. Harvey, break our stalemate. What is this? Another invasion? Warriors from Jotunheim. They attack from all fronts. While we sit on our trembling hands and scratch our bums. Not so, Thor. Many Aesir have been sent to the four corners of Asgard, leaving we four to defend the Great Hall. Havi, lend me a score of your warriors and I will lead them into Jotunheim myself. We cannot afford such a loss. The Ain Hariar must hold back to defend our city. I would bring them here. To hold the Great Hall itself. This invasion is too large to spread ourselves around. All this prattle solves nothing. Battle or death! Silence! All of you. We will take the fight to the enemy before they cross the Bifrost. Well said, Ravenfeeder. Name those who may fight beside you. I need only one. You, Tyr, Lord of Justice. We'll gather our forces and scatter the enemy like grains. <clears throat> yes, I will fight as a thresher through a field of weeds, Mad One. The rest of you, stay back to protect the Great Hall. Were any creatures among the Jotnar? Drago, trolls, or wolves? What troubles you, Havi? Does your far side tell you something? More invaders! They gather at the Bifrost Bridge! Where's Loki? He should be guarding that door! Warn the others. The fight begins. 
I'm with you, Abby. Let's deal out some punishment. <laughs> With me, the rest of you got the great hall. With me, I gift this battle to myself. What's that? You've done us no favors here, Jotun. Wait, no! Harvey! I found this one lurking in the shade, shying from battle. Shall I extract some teeth to get him talking? Or pluck out an eye? You were told to guard this portal, Loki. What happened? The portal opened, and these soldiers came bleeding through. So I sent warning straight away. And I captured this one, the soggy child sheep herder. <laughs> what is your name, stranger? I am called the Builder by most. He wants your name, not your trade. If I have another name, it's not within my memory. Builder it's been for as long as I've been building things.
Do you come from Jotunheim? I do. Or I did. That is to say, I passed through. But I am not of that place, which pleases me well, for I hated it. Had you any dealings there? As a builder, yes. For a time. But they took a dislike to my methods, which are, shall I say, magical in nature. Harvey, when someone gifts you a horse, you ride it. I put a bridle on this one. Is that right, Builder? Are you a gift horse? Or a secret curse? Neither, Hywan. I am only a tool. One with hopes to be well used. This portal has been a source of misery for some time. I want it sealed. With respect, this is not the only way the Yotnar can enter Asgard. May I propose a more encompassing solution? Quite a coincidence that you came when you did, at the tail end of a brutal attack. That I came when I did was by design. I have been among your enemies for so long, I know how they hunger for your demise. If you doubt me, I could offer a demonstration. A demonstration, yes. And if he fails to impress, we hoist his skin as a sail. I'll accept these terms, with the last condition. I would need water from your well of Urth. What do you know of our sacred well? It's a place of great power and vital magic, a source of spirit. It's the water there that will power your shield. I'll collect the water, Harvey. Keep this one clear of our sacred sites. Loki, halt! I will go to the well. You must find this builder clearing for his display. No, no. It's no trouble, Harvey. The damp and the dark appeal to me. Go with the builder, then return to the Great Hall with news of our next step. As you command. An interesting offer. A curious coincidence. Fight, but I wish there were more. <laughs> the sky itself shadows before your might fall. <laughs> Death to all you not. Asgard belongs to the Aesir. We are undefeated.
thoughts are clouded with shadows of doom. Even this peaceful valley seems to hold hidden dangers. Not even I know all your secrets. Sunstone has been moved. The light's path is shifted. He said you'd be here. He told me of the Builder's request, an offer that gives me great worry. Why was this passage blocked? Has someone been here recently? Do you hear me, Javi? This Builder is a stranger to us. We know not what he intends. I am the King of Asgard, Tyr. Do not question my desire to protect her. Calm, old friend. What's needling you?
The Nornir told me I would die at Ragnarok. They described the scene of my passing. All but a few will perish in the final battle. We know this. Yet we will die well. And live again in great and glorious tales. I will need your strength in the coming days. To anchor me. To challenge me. To pull me back from the abyss should I teeter. And I will. As long as breath fills me. So I must caution you. Step with care in this place. What happens here may ripple through the fabric of the Nine Worlds. <laughs> the well is sealed. Someone labors to keep me out. Perhaps it is meant as a warning. I will take it as a challenge. I recall there being more light in here. These sunstones are meant to guide the light, but the path has been diverted. What if an invader was trying to weaken the well's defenses? Are we meant to intervene? The integrity of this sacred place must be preserved. But whether we be a bane or a boon remains to be seen. There are two targets the light must strike, but only one stream. How do two farms share one source of water? By splitting the stream.
Once or twice, the light has found its mark, the stone is lit. I doubt the Nornir will appreciate our visit. The curious are not welcome here. We will have come and gone before they feel our presence. is open to us. I will lead. I'll suffer no wolves in Asgard. This is a sacred place. Killing here is forbidden. You know this, Javi. Has your mind fled you? You act as though possessed by the spirit of another. The Nornir warned me. A wolf will be my doom at Ragnarok. Will you slay every wolf in the Nine Realms to sidestep this fate? <laughs> Ridiculous. Take this beast. I want it caged. 
I would have every wolf and dog in Asgard caged if I could. To ease your troubled mind, I will do as you ask. We need you focused for the coming war. Thank you, Couragebringer, for your steady hand. When one descends this deep, there's no going back up. Then the only way is further down. to the well, did you not? And you found what you were looking for? I have a skin of sacred water, yes. Is the builder preparing his demonstration? How did the well look? Peaceful, calm, quiet? What are you driving at, Loki? Driving at? I'm only curious. The well is a wondrous place. I wish I could see it for myself. There was a wolf cup with us, trespassing on sacred ground. But Tyr took care of it. Took care of it? Is he dead? The wolf lives. But Tyr will cage the beast at his hall. I want no free wolves in Asgard. Ah, yes. Good. A wise decision, Harvey. I wanted to kill it, but Tyr stayed my hand. Tyr is pragmatic, and it serves him well. You should heed him more often. Now tell me plainly, where is the Builder? In a meadow not far from here. Your raven may find the way. Show me what lies ahead. the perfect spot. Did you bring the water? As promised. Wonderful. As it blends with my paint, its magic will power the runes of protection that I here inscribe. No rune will protect you from my wrath if I catch you playing games. A perfect mix. Wait, what are you doing? Harnessing Hooker magic to bind my spirit to these enchantments. It amplifies the strength. Hooker magic? You learned this from the Jotnar? They practice a form of Hooker magic, but this is my own technique. And it's just about done. 
Could you lend a hand and bring me a few jars of paint? As many as you can. Be careful with that jar. It's fragile. Easy. Remember, just place it. Don't break it. Do take care. We can replace the paint, but the time to prepare it is lost. That's well enough. Exactly the right spot. What now, Builder? Perhaps you should move out of the way. Atop that rock, the view will be much better. There. Will that do? It will indeed. Hold, hold, and there it is, a thing of beauty. The runes you painted conjured the shield. They did. And if all goes well, it will protect your allies and roast your enemies. Show me. With pleasure. Draw some invaders out from the woods and into the shield. Alive, of course. They must be alive. The barrier will not harm me as I cross? You have my word. Over here, you stinking sh Am I so fearsome that you hide like mice in a farmer's field? Look at that, like moths to a flame. Come, you fatherless curse. I'm one, and you're many. What have you got to lose? The fools, they run towards their doom. Your shield is failing, Builder. They are passing through. I don't understand. This should be that Builder, your shield has failed. No, not at all. I just need to make some adjustments. Builder, your shield summons an army, but it's as weak as your word.
not what you promised. Never mind that now. They're coming from all sides. Don't fall for any trap. I should have let Loki have his way with you. You need to fix this now! I'm painting as fast as I can. Bring the power down. Patient, look for the open. Sour fruit, not as sweet as you promised. It held. The shield worked wonders. It worked well enough. Impressive, but unstable. Don't fear, my friend. The problem is no more. I have mixed the proper solution. With enough materials and the right incentive, I pledge to build a tower so tall it would shield all of Asgard. Materials we can find, that is no issue. What incentive do you mean? Oh, just a trifle. Nothing grand. I only want Freya as my wife and queen. You name an impossible prize builder. Is that your trick? Aim high to land somewhere in the center? I don't haggle like a common fishmonger, Hobbit. I desire Freya with all my heart. So ask yourself. Is one marriage a fair exchange for the salvation of Asgard and its people? Freya is not mine to barter like a bale of wheat. I will ask her what she desires. Do what you must, but my price stands firm. No Freya, no shield. I have no other needs. And you have no other friends, so tread lightly here.
your eyes, my friend. Look at the size of this beautiful creature. Impressive, isn't it? Clear eyes, strong haunches. It must come from powerful stock. You fools. It could swallow the moon next month if it continues to grow like this. I know your mind, Javi. But this wolf is not your enemy. The signs of Ragnarok, when it comes, will be clear for all to see. Till, you roll bones in a game you do not understand. That may be. But I'll assume the risk. If there's a price to be paid, I'll pay it. It's the Jotnar that trouble us now. Have you spoken with the Builder? The Builder, yes. Is Freya nearby? She's teaching Thor about organizing armies. A battle they're both losing. Come along then. You must all hear what I have to say. spoke with the Builder. You saw his work. I did. These markings are your warriors. Enough of this sorcery, woman. Just point me towards the enemy and I will handle them. Havi, you look troubled. The Builder gave me a demonstration of his magic. He conjured a shield that killed invaders on contact. That would do well for us. But your expression says otherwise. I fear the price is too high. What does he want? You. Me? Does he take us for slavers? I will smash his skull till he shits out brains! Now hold on, everyone. Let's weigh the- Do not finish that thought. What was your reply? I told him it was your choice alone. You didn't refuse him outright? I evaded his question to gain us time. Time to devise a better idea. One that does not involve selling off your queen, I trust. How about I beat on his liver till he builds us a wall for free? Might we consider... I will not barter with my body. That would be a first. Hold on. 
I've got it. The blunt end of my hammer on his family stones. You are overthinking this, all of you. Give this builder an impossible task, a deadline of, say, nine days. When he forfeits, as he no doubt will, Freya remains free, and we may finish his work as intended. He would be mad or stupid to agree. You underestimate men of intellect, Lord of Storms. The Builder is a proud man. He won't back down from a challenge. I do not like this. Nor do I, but we must act. Loki, bring this offer to the Builder. Your will is my deed, Rune Writer. You grapple with forces outside your control. You were eager to see the deal done. We're Asir. She's Vada. Watch out! Keep your distance! The wolf! Shit! Tyr, stand back! I'll get it! Away. The wolf is mine! Stand clear! I will catch it. I'll sharpen my the axe with your teeth, beast! beast. <laughs> you worthy! The final blow is mine. Do not fight the beast! Leave it to me! Are you my doom? Are you destined to destroy me? I am the Death Walker! I am the living ghost! I cannot die! We will see which is stronger, your fate or my will.
If I spare your life, will you do the same? I've warned you well, and look where it has led! Savi, stop! Stay your ex! my way, Loki! You swore an oath to never spill my blood. Step aside, and I won't have to. This is my blood! What? He is my son! Bastard! Tyr, you've cared for this wolf. You will be his jailer. Take it to Lingby. Find it there. Make sure it never leaves the island. I can speak with the dwarf Ivaldi. May he find a more permanent solution. will be a reckoning. Of this, I have no doubt. Darkened like an ill omen. My impossible task grows more urgent.
I was only curious, Dwarf. I meant no offense. I'm merely a seeker of knowledge. The Dwarves give nothing away for free. Apologies for the distraction, Master Blacksmith. I'll leave you to your work. Well, what shall I craft for you today, High One? Bottomless breaches for soiling yourself on the battlefield? What were you and the Builder discussing? Harvey, my gentle jailer. You know we dwarves give nothing away for free. If you want your question answered, I'll need something in return. Such as? A hidden fact known only to you, Farseer. That I may share in your secret knowledge of the world. The winds that blow over the sea are stirred by the wings of a great eagle named Helsvig, who sits at the edge of the sky. Interesting indeed. I've often wondered at its source. So, you asked what that sack of sheep guts was after? He wanted to know how magic affected your hooger. Why would he want to know the effect of magic on my spirit? Not just you, Harvey. The lot of you. Acid and Vanir alike. I told him to shovel his shit somewhere else. Now, if that's all you came to know, you can piss off and let me work. I have one more need. Can you forge me an unbreakable chain? Chains are overrated. One weak link and it's worthless. Let me craft the cord that Thor himself could not break. It must be strong enough to bind a powerful beast. I will sluice my sweat into this cord, Harvey. All knowledge I have and skill I own will define it. And what will I get in return? My thanks and my hospitality. What more could you need? Ugh. You cannot barter with a man who's squeezing your balls. You may always return to the land of fire, Ivaldi. ...and die as your brothers did, roasted on a spit. Hmm. To craft such a cord, I'll need a few impossible ingredients. Name them. I the list there. I have a bear's tendon, a fish's breath, and... A cat's footsteps? And the root of a mountain? How do I find these? How the fuck would I know? The riddles will guide you. I have no patience for riddles, Dwarf. Those riddles are as ancient as the world, with lore passed down from Nii and Nidi to Northri and Sudri, Austri and Vestri, Althjover. I understand. I will return shortly.
Cast about this land, my friend. Statues. Who put you up here, little cat? So that's how it is. Lead the way, nimble one. to go.
He has made the base already. The builder works fast, a bit too fast. They will attack on sight here. and I seek. There's no higher peak.
this area is off limits. Huh? <laughs> 
Looks like the right place. I swear there is the seed in the mountain's rocky grip. Some heat may free it from its shell. The seed will not sprout root until I get it into some water. before it takes hold. Let's see what you can make of these, Ivaldi.
How is he building that tower so quickly? There's more to this stranger than meets the eye. I found everything you asked for. How soon can you finish this unbreakable cord? As soon as it wants to be made. You cannot rush this kind of magic. It flows with a speed all its own. Find me as soon as it's ready. By the way, after we spoke of the Hoogar, a cousin came by with his own spirit tale. I don't trust coincidence, so this one's free. What did he say? He told me his sister's husband, Borin, drank a mead brewed in Jotunheim, and it sent his hooger into a goat. The spirit of a dwarf in the body of a goat? <laughs> Stranger still, his sister didn't even notice. Heavy! Don't drag me into this. The tower is nearly finished. Do not fret. The final hours are ticking down. Not fast enough. I feel the jaws of a trap closing upon me. Knowing you are in a trap is the first step to avoiding it. You don't care if I'm married off to this builder, do you? Have no fear, Freya. Whatever things transpire today, you marrying the builder will not be among them. At least have the sense to admit you betrayed my trust. I was wrong to use you like that. I will confront the Builder and pry the truth out of him. A limp apology, but it will suffice for now. Once the Builder is dealt with, turn your spear on Loki. Every chance he had, he dug us deeper into this mess. If Loki is up to something, I will see to it that he is punished. Blood Oath be damned.
He finished the tower. Have we been outplayed? My best work, but it has a certain glow. Now then, where's my queen? You're finished. The tower is functional. One rune remains, which I shall inscribe after I am wet. Who helped you complete the work, Builder? You could not have managed so quickly on your own. Our agreement said nothing about outside help. Now, where is Frey? I tire of waiting. Outside help. Interesting choice of words. Hail, Harvey. Hail, Builder. We bring you your bride. Freya, my beloved. Why does she leer so wickedly? She agreed to marry you for the sake of Asgard, but she is not warmed by the idea. In fact, you revolt her utterly. If she hopes to dissuade me from this union, she'll be quite disappointed. I am committed to seeing this through. Enough chatter. We have upheld our end of the bargain. Will you finish your work? I'm sorry, but I've never seen such wild eyes. Why does she look so feral? She was shocked into a waking sleep at the news of her betrothal. She prefers this dreamlike state to the ugly reality. It will be a rude awakening if she does not come around willingly. I will not use her gently. Quit stalling and kiss her, Dungmeat! Consummate your betrothal! Yes, a kiss. A brief taste to whet my appetite. Delicious! Your lips are two <laughs> pillows on a bed of rain rose petals. And yours are cold and rough as unpolished stone. What trickery is this? Is something wrong? Her voice! It's hideous! I have been told it has a seductive quality. By a wolf. Treachery! Bring me the real fray, or my offer is withdrawn! I'll bring myself, if you don't mind. Freya, you don't need you to... You have next to nothing, Esir. Only this useless monument to your ineptitude. Uh... You've been a good boy, Thor. Don't gamble your winnings. <clears throat> and you, Havi. You tried to avoid responsibility by not making a choice, but that was a choice in itself. And look where it has brought us.
You are no one's prize just yet. If this scheme turns sour, I will fight for you till my sinews snap and my bones break. Has this sad spectacle been for my sake alone? I've seen better drama on the festering carcass of a dead pig. Finish your work or suffer. No Freya, no shield. To hell I am with him, Harvey. I know where he keeps his enchanted paint. Show me. Thor, Tyr, watch our guests closely. Freya, I hope we will have words when this is done. Why do you still wear Freya's form? A reminder of who's at stake. Change back. This is disturbing. Where do we go now? I don't know. I didn't say I was watching him every moment. Kept his supplies. He never left his area. Mostly never. We have found the worm's lair. Oh, such. The builder will suffer for this. Hold, Loki. We need to talk. What is it, Harvey? Loki? Did you know this builder before we met him at Heimdall's tower? Did I know him? As in friends? Or know of him? Did you invite him here? I... I did, yes. He rescued my son from Jotunheim, so I agreed to bring him here and help him find work. That's all. Make this right, Loki, or the blood oath that binds me is forfeit. For you and your son, is that clear? As a cloudless sky, high one. More deer. Go ahead. That's cold comfort. Emir's blood. Look. 
Slay these shapeshifters. It appears we've underestimated him. On your advice. Find some way to hinder his efforts, or I will offer you as his price. I live to serve, Raven Feeder. Our happy returns. Stay right there, Builder. We're not finished with you. You survived my trap. How disappointing. Invaders from Jotunheim. We slaughtered them all. Buris Balsak. Can I kill him now? We do not need this honor cheat. We will complete the tower ourselves. My Hoogr makes it work. I am bound to it through the magic of your realm. You perverted our sacred waters. We have every reason to kill you. Well reasoned. They should call you the god of hindsight, all-knowing after the fact. I will finish the inscription. Builder, you stay with me. You others go. Elhas, for protection. You godless worm, slayer of my kin, oath breaker, spirit taker, I didn't build this tower to keep your enemies out. I built it to keep you in. You thought. Their lives were the price of their arrogance. His head is exposed. How do I reach it? Better shot at his head from above.
shape the nine worlds, but you do not control them. Control them? I only wish to survive them. Turning back the seasons. If our mission is assured, I will ensure that you share it. His magic dies with him. Does that worry you, trickster? What are you implying? Were you behind this? You dishonorable truth tangler. What do you know of honor, Freya? You've fed it more men than all the halls in Midgard. You're a fine one to talk of sexual appetites. You fathered a wolf cop. I'll not hear a lecture from the Lord of Petty Rules, who stiffens at the thought of laying down the law. And before you threaten to brandish your hammer, Thor, remember, without it, you'd be no better than a troll. Only twice as stupid. Oh, you festering ball sack swollen with the foulest drippings of Emir's corpse. No oath is worth this abuse. But you won't break it, Harvey. You cannot. All your efforts to evade destiny will only fling you further along its course. If you're not careful, you may be the author of your own destruction. <clears throat> Leave him. He will do little harm while his son remains captive. A mouthful of iron would put a stop to his babbling. What now, wise one? We have returned to the place from which we set out. Ragnarok is coming, and we are no safer. There may be a solution in Jotunheim. Huga magic, they call it. I will travel there to see it for myself. Until I have the final binding, Lokistan must not leave that island. In time, it shall serve as a sanctuary for all wolves. I will watch over him, as one of my own kin. Then I'll leave the realm in your capable hands, my queen. If my own are empty when I return, I will accept destiny with both.
Welcome back. Your face is bright, and your eyes seem clearer. Tell me of everything you have seen. I... Uh, I've been to Asgard, the seat of the gods. I consorted with Loki, the trickster. We quarreled often, as siblings. But soon our fights grew dark. When he revealed he had sired a wolf cub, my rage was unbound. Because he had hid the truth from you? Yes, because he knew that wolves were not allowed in Asgard. He flaunted my command. Perhaps this was the purpose of your vision. To overcome an inner fear and find forgiveness in your heart. Maybe. But before my vision ended, I was seized by great purpose. I devised a plan, a voyage to Jotunheim. And then I awoke. Interesting. Was there anything else? I saw through Odin's eyes, just as you said. In every vision, I inhabited his form, lived as he once lived. In his body, I was myself, but I was carried by his whims. His thoughts were as known to me as my own. We were two, but we existed as one. And what have you learned? More than learned. I felt, I felt everything. His fears and doubts, his loves and passions. Incredible. What else? I heard a prophecy. Warning of Ragnarok, the destruction of the world, the end of all time, and the Nordnir. They warned me of the great wolf Fenrir, and how he hungered for my blood. But there was something else. Hope. I was undaunted by the coming cataclysm. Perhaps this aspect of your vision inspires bravery. Truly, you are touched by the gods. Was there more? There was nothing more. Nothing of great significance. The dream has faded. Eivor. Your visions are unlike any I have encountered. Leave me now. I must think on what you have shared. <laughs>